Yo, what's up everybody? This is again Lian and welcome back to our channel where we review and unbox Gundam kits and gadgets. Well, today we have a special unboxing of 90s kit that will uh, bring us back to all days. So, no? so ito yung introduce sa atin ng Gundam, especially sa mga batang 90s. Well, before that, I would like to say na guys, stay safe tayo dapat. Nasa loob natin ng bahay, especially ngayon naman ng lockdown. At inaharap natin yung problema sa COVID-19. So, so guys, you need to stay healthy, stay safe, stay home lang kayo ngayon. Lockdown tayo during the COVID-19. Maroon lang kayo ng mga paborit niyong series dyan, YouTube videos, and especially yung video ko, panoorin nyo rin, para rin maging entertaining sa atin during our lockdown sa mga bahay. So guys, let's start with unboxing. And today, we're going to unbox the Hybrid After Colony 1 to 1 Portable Scale of Wing Gundam Zero! So now guys, to start the unboxing of the uh, High Grade Wing Gundam Zero, here's the uh, box art. Yung kanyang side. Other side niya. Then this side shows yung pinaka pose niya, ibang articulation, accessories niya, and some Japanese text na <laughs> hindi natin alam basahin. And then the other side is yung same din naman yung design sa harapan. And now let's see what lurks inside this box. Now when we open the box, we're greeted of three sets of runners. We have this one. Then itong mga white for the wings and then particularly mga gray parts and white white and yellow parts ng kit and then the manual. Now, for the first set of runners, we have the SB13. So, mainly ito yung clear part na green sa kanyang beam saber. Yan yun. Next, we do have set of blue runners and that's the runner letter D. So mainly andito yung kanyang chest part, yung kanyang back skirt, part ng wings, arms niya, yung kanyang likod, and yung blue part sa kanyang shoulders. Ito yun. Next runner is runner letter C, mainly for the red parts. Ito yung kanyang shield part, yung kanyang feet. Uh, kanyang side skirt pa rin and then yung some red parts sa kanyang torso and yung kanyang arms na rin or yung kanyang shoulders andyan na rin yun. Now for the next set of runners first runner is runner A2 yan so ito naman yung mga white parts niya mainly for the legs well prominent yung wings niya dyan may kita ninyo yung wings niya some white parts sa kanyang um, shield na armor sa kanyang feet and legs na rin nandiyan yun next runner is yung polycaps niya or yung kanyang polycap which is the uh, PC002 napaka konti ng polycaps na to and um, I'm really glad to see na well do meron pa rin naman na polycaps pero hindi na siya kagaya ng mga old school na polycaps na ang dami ito yun Next set of runner is, well, it's just one part lang naman and ito yung kanyang clear green which is the E2. 
So, I'm glad to see na so far ngayon, nag-provide ng green clear part si Bandai for the uh, Zero or yung sa gitna ng chest ng Wing uh, Zero. Yun nga lang sa mga gustong mag-customize uh, dyan, hindi na siya yung clear part na pwede yung kulay ng ibang color. It's in green na. And I'm, again, I'm glad to see that it, it's clear green naman. Next is yung kanyang sticker. Yan yung sa kanyang eyes, yung sa kanyang shield parts, and yung kanyang... Well, kung gusto nyo gamitin yung green na yon sa kanyang chest, pwede rin. Though, clear green naman na yun. Okay, next set of runner naman. Yung unang runner dito is yung runner E1. Well, this runner naman is for the... Uh, shield part, some yellow part sa kanyang arms, and then yung kanyang V-fin, nandito na rin yan sa runner E1. Yung pagka-yellow niya, hopefully ma-capture sa camera, pero hindi siya yung parang yellow na may konting shade of orange. Plain yellow lang siya, and uh, I'm glad to see na ang ganda ng pagkakagawa ng mold dito sa yellow parts na to. Especially sa V-fin niya. Next runner, we have the runner A1. And uh, more parts dito ng kanyang shield. And dito na rin yung kanyang front skirts. Some leg parts. And then yung wings. Prominent na prominent yung wings na yan sa kanyang runner na to. And then yung kanyang... And then yung other white parts ng kanyang legs. Andiyan na rin. Last runner, we have the runner letter B. Andito yung kanyang gray parts for the beam saber, yung kanyang manipulators, some parts ng kanyang uh, booster sa likod, and yung some gray parts pa rin na makikita ninyo sa kit na to and so on. Lastly is yung kanyang manual. Ito yun. So ito yung kanyang front view. Colored yung ilang parts. Pretty straightforward naman sa high grade yung gantong klaseng manual. For the high grade wing Gundam Zero, it has 11 parts that includes 9 runners, 1 manual, and 1 sticker. And I'm really glad to see na talagang pagating sa high grade, Bandai really step it up. I can see more parts here, di gaya ng araw ng mga high grade, talagang mas maganda yung high grade series nila ngayon. And I'm glad to say that uh, Bandai is the best when it comes to modeling kit talaga. And there you go guys, thank you so much for watching the awesome and great unboxing ng Gundam kit na to. I hope that you've enjoyed watching our unboxing and stay tuned kayo sa review ng mga awesome kits natin. So that's all. Again guys, be safe during this time. Stay healthy sa inyo and always pray to God. And as always, chill!